guys, welcome back to my channel. Sarah here with another 30 inks, 30 days. If you watched yesterday's video, um, I said that I am cheating a little bit today. I've also just realized that I'm filming upside down. Um, that's all right, I'll fix that. Um, Q's hard, so I've gone with smoky quartz and I think that that's okay. Ooh, someone's vacuuming outside next door or something so that's what I've gone with I think it still fits in with the rules uh, because I make them <laughs> so that's what we're going to do today uh, righty for those um participating in 30 inks 30 days i'd love to know how you feel you're going i feel like we're really on like the last leg of it now um or for those watching has this made you like definitely want to do 30 inks 30 days for the next month or definitely not it can have the opposite effect i'm sure um yeah i'd love to know what like what the experience has been thus far let's try to do a little bit more of a circle oh i didn't say this is a pelican ink sorry it's one of the ink of the year inks um that could have been helpful to tell you guys. So it's a brown for me. This is a brown like on the cooler side. Like when I look at that, I see more like yellows and greens coming through than I do like reds and, and oranges. Um, but where it goes really light, like just in there, that probably looks like the warmest bit for me. And that gets cooler and then it starts to get warmer as it um gets you know wetter more ink down so let's i always find these vials a bit tricky to get ink in let's see how we go let's see if we make spelling mistakes today like we did yesterday even though it was on the other page see i didn't get enough there I said, you know, I watch some incredible YouTubers and they have like the most slick videos. Like they never have ink on their hands. They just always look fantastic. I just feel like I can never quite get there. Anyway, this is, what's this one? Pelican. If that's feathered a little bit there oh it feels much nicer on the medium nib this ink that's a really obvious difference a word for today is cum which collinsdictionary.com tells me is a word of british origin and it means to please satisfy or mitigate this ink feels really nice on this nib but it didn't feel as nice there but maybe i didn't get enough on i actually think it looks better on the medium nib as well it looks so much better i think on with this nib getting some bits of shading oh well, that's cool there's almost like a little um tiny bit of like a red halo wing going on there um I'm not sure, like I'm, I'm kind of in the beginning phases of really trying to use browns. Uh, I can't see myself using something like this. I think at the moment I'm definitely heading towards those um, warmer toned browns as, versus cooler ones. Um, but I'm sure there are people who who like kind of browns on, on this side of the spectrum versus the, the warmer ones. Um, awesome. As always, once this dries, we will jump over and just add it to our monthly swatch. See you guys in a sec. All right, let's do this. I've realized that this today is a bit of a quick one. I haven't meant to rush, um, but I think I have a little bit. So I'll, I'll try and remind myself to slow down a bit tomorrow. Um, but I guess sometimes quick videos are okay as well. Let's come out the side there. I 
I'm just reminding myself to not complain about this measuring cup because I feel like I have in, if not every video, the majority <laughs> of videos. Didn't even get it in the, the square there. So this is Pelican, Smoky Quartz. Awesome. Thank you so much for hanging with me today. Email is just a quick hang. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.